Okay, so here we are. This is what you're probably going to get when you open up VS Code the first time. And it's it's pretty simple. There's not much to it, as you can see. The, the most that we're going to spend our time in is going to be this explorer. So here is where our, our files and folders are going to be. Then we have the search. So later on in our code, if we want to search for something specific, we can do that here. And we can also replace it too. These two we're not going to cover yet. Uh, because they're not going to be helpful for us for now. Uh, but then we have this marketplace here, so the extensions. And here we can basically add different functionalities to our VS Code. And we can also add some themes and new icons uh, if we prefer. So I'm going to add a few and I'm kind of going to explain what they do. The first one is I kind of want to change the color of this. I'm not a huge fan of it. <laughs> if you want, you can leave it like this. Uh, but I'm going to change mine. So what I'm going to search for is material theme. And this one is a pretty nice looking one. So it's the first one here. It's by Mattia Astorino. I'm sorry if I misspelled your name, but you're going to hit install here. I'm just going to enable it. And then what you can do is set color theme here. All right. You can click that and then you have all of these different themes. Uh, what I'm going to set it to is this Pelonite high contrast. I, I believe this looks very good. I like the way it looks. Uh, so I'm going to keep this one. Another one is going to be right the one below it, the material icon team. This just changes up the icons. Again, this is just super optional. You don't really have to install it, but I'm going to install it. Okay. And then we're going to choose material icon team here. Another way you can access if maybe you want to change it again is you can go to the wrench down here and go to the command palette. And for some reason, when you're in the extensions here, it closes, it's bugging out. I'm not sure why, but if we close this up, it, it should open up now. And here you can search for color team. Okay. You can just type in here or maybe it might pop up here, but if it doesn't, you can search color team and here later on, you can pick one that you like. Okay. So those are the first two. Now I'm going to install just one more and then throughout the course, we might add another one or two to it. Okay. But these two I want to change. And there's another one that's very important, which is going to be live server. So make sure you search for live server. It's going to be this one by Ritwick Bay with 3 million downloads and make sure to install that as well. And that's going to be it. We're going to close this up. And let's start writing our first HTML code. Hey, exciting.